If you don't like pain, you probably won't like this dish. Hi strangers, it's Mandy. Welcome to Escapism Cooking. Um, I'm with Fu52. Today we're going to be making something called smashed fried chicken in chili sambal. This is not a fried chicken recipe because it's more like a way of eating fried chicken than a fried chicken recipe. So think of it more like a technique than a precise recipe. So here I have KFC and I have Jollibee. These are the two brands that I feel like are um, most suitable for this recipe because you want a fried chicken that has a very nice Crust. This is a great recipe for using like a day old fried chicken. So I'm going to rebake these in a 225 Celsius oven for like about five minutes just to crisp it back up. Okay, if you have an air fryer, you can use that too. Now let's talk about the chilies. Here in Asia, I would recommend these like long green chilies. Don't use those like wide big ones because those has no heat. It's more like a bell pepper. Don't use bell pepper. If you don't like spicy things, don't, don't do this, okay? And here is a typical Thai red chilies. So this is when you really want to up the heat level. You can add um, one or two of these, okay? So if you're in America, you don't have these, you can substitute this with jalapeno. And these you should have anywhere you go, okay? So. Those are the options, and now I'm gonna show you how to do this. Very, very simple. Open flame. I have a little, you know, grilling rack that's set on top. High heat. And I just throw these on there. We're not trying to cook them completely. We're just gonna char their skin and give it a little smoky flavor. But I don't want them to be completely softened. So once it's like this, it's ready. Put that aside. Again, you don't want these to become too soft. There. Now we're gonna do the same thing to the garlics. And the same principle applies. We're not trying to roast these garlic, you know, or make them soft or caramelize them or anything like that. I'm just looking to char the surface a little bit. There, ready. And that is it. I just give it a nice spanking. I use a little knife here to like kind of stir it around. And I just char it until it's starting to brown. There. Okay. And that's it. Okay, so the fried chickens are ah, hot, hot, hot. Nice and crisp, crisped up. Okay. So that's good. Just leave that aside until you need them. But obviously don't do it way too ahead of time. So now I'm just going to remove the stems of these chilies. Add the shrimp paste, a little smasher, whatever you have, okay? And I'm gonna start smashing it. I'm doing this in a bowl because those seeds are gonna be flying everywhere. Now it's fairly mashed, right? You don't need them to be a puree. Now I'm gonna season this with white pepper. If you only have black, that's fine, but white pepper, white pepper does not taste like black pepper. And I prefer white pepper. White, 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 white. I'm gonna add a little bit of mayonnaise because that's for moisture. If you don't, um, if you don't like mayonnaise, you don't have to. Here comes the fun part. I'm going to add my fried chicken in. I prefer thighs. Do you have to debone it? Nope. You gonna smash the shit out of this fried chicken. You're gonna toss and turn it, but this is not, this is gonna be a super ugly recipe. Nothing pretty about this, but it's very, very yummy. I'm gonna add just a tad bit of salt. Did you 
talk about the origin of the dish? I saw a video of some of um, a food YouTuber eating this in Indonesia. That's the origin. Time to taste it. It's not pretty, okay? I'm not gonna lie. This is not something you're gonna, you know, visually impress anyone with. But it, it's so, so yummy. If you want to remove the bones, you can. I, I don't. It's part of the fun of like sucking on it, you know, while you eat, okay? So, here we go. Yum. Wow, a lot of heat. If you don't like spicy things, don't do not do this. Immediately burning, but that is the fun part. There's no point using a bell pepper for this recipe. The point of eating this is to feel pain, okay? And that is part of the fun. If you don't like pain, you probably won't like this dish. So yummy, I don't even wanna talk anymore. I'm gonna go back to this. Try this recipe. It's super fun. Really, really fun way to eat fried chicken. If you are bored with fried chicken, this is what I'm gonna do about this. So, see you next time. Bye.